Okay, so we select our file which has been saved as a DXF. And we open that up. And now you can see that we've got our drawing already on the machine. So we double click this one here and that'll open up our, um, our transform vectors page where we then can put in our different uh, settings. So basically we've selected where we want it to start from and we're starting 10 mil in from uh, X and Y on the machine. And then we scroll down here and you've got different settings which you can change which uh, you don't need to change any of the others really. Hit apply and basically that's now moved the drawing into the bottom corner of our workpiece and you can see we've got 10 mil from here, 10 mil from here uh, and that's where we've decided that we're going to be cutting from. Now we go to tool paths down the bottom here and we select uh, 2D profiling this will open up the um, box for setting all your different settings, your cut um, and your uh, tool settings. So you've got outside and inside. Basically that means it's going to cut from the outside of the line or the inside of the line. So for instance on this drawing, we want to cut the outside of the line on this one here because it's the outside of the object. And then um, on the inside we would do the circles because we want it to then cut from the inside. And um, what we want to do is we want to select which ones we want to cut and which ones cut outside. So you hold down shift and then you can click uh, each vet, each line. You can see what we're doing here. And then that'll select what we want to do. Then we've got our finishing depth. So we can make it say six mil or if you want to cut all the way through your material. and then you've got machine safeties. So basically that means that when the machine is going from moving from one position to another, it'll lift up 10 millimeters and move over to the next position and then start cutting. If you make it higher, it just slows down the process. It means it'll lift up higher and um, run to there. Then you've got our home position Z. So we set this one a little bit higher because this means that when it goes to its home position, it's 65 mil above um, anything which uh, might be you have some clamps and things like that so you want to make sure that your uh, when the machine is moving it goes up above that into its position and then starts the cut from there